Among Us is a great game and a popular one too. And because of that, I see a lot of clips where there are reports or discussions and every time people say Red Sus, Vol Red, Red Fake Task, Red Follows Me and so on. But why? Almost every game I see everyone is a species of Red like he killed a grandma or something. I want to give justice to Red. So I've done research and this is what I found. Based on color theory and color psychology, every color that we see triggers a certain feeling and a reaction to the human brain. Companies are using color theory to their advantage by using this reaction to their benefit. Biggest example, Coca-Cola's main color is red. Red invokes power, excitement, energy and passion. It also stimulates the appetite which makes it an excellent choice when branding food or drink. Coming back to Among Us colors, why red? Why red is the most sus out of many colors of the game? The color red stimulates our brain to take action. It portrays fear, survival, and we can show aggression depending on the context of it. So depending on the context of Among Us, where you have 10 players and two of them are the enemy, you are more likely to suspect red than, for example, green. Because the color red inflicts fear and aggression in your brain, it is energetic color. When you see the color red, you are remembered by your brain about everyday reminders. For for example, fire, which is a threat to your ape brain. The red light on traffic, which you are stimulated by it subconsciously to stop when you see it every time. Whereas the color green is a calming color. When you see green, you are subconsciously reminded of forest and nature, which is accompanied with the color green. It is refreshing and it has a calming effect. In contrast, there are two colors that are different, stimulating factors in your brain. So what are you gonna suspect more? Green, a calming color? or red, an aggressive stimulating color. Of course, the red color does not resemble only aggression and threat. It can also mean, as I said before, excitement, sexual passion, in which I don't think people vote red because it's very sexy. <laughs> so I don't think that's gonna do anything with why red is so suspicious. Additionally, the APS, aka the Association for Psychological Science, released an article in 2011 in which they focused on the topic of color red. Check this shit. Almost universally, red means stop. Red means danger, red means hot. And analyzing their results in 2004 Olympics, researchers have found that red also means dominance. Athletes wearing red prevail more often than those wearing blue, especially in hand-to-hand -hand in sports like wrestling. Why? Is it random, is it cultural, or does it have evolutionary roots? A new study of male races, macaques, <laughs> strongly suggest its evolution. The similarity of our results with those of humans suggests that avoiding red or acting submissively in its presence may stem from an inherited psychological predisposition. Neuroscientist Gerald D. Kralik, who collaborated with, on the study with his research assistants Sarah A. Kahn and William J. Levine, and anthropologist Seth D. Dobson, also at Dartmouth, aka smart people. The study involved male races uh, I'm not spelling that monkeys, a species of old world monkeys that is insensitive to the red, green and blue, raging freely in Cayo Santiago, Puerto Rico. Two human experimenters, one male and one female, entered the monkeys colony and found isolated males to test. Both people knelt down, placed a styrofoam tray in front of them, drew an apple slice from the backpacks, held the slice at chest level for the monkey to see, then placed the apple on the trays. Both stood up simultaneously and took two steps back. The monkey typically went directly to the slice he wanted, ran off and ate it. The humans wore t-shirts and caps whose colors red, green and blue were changed in each of four conditions. Red on female, green on male, then vice versa. Red versus blue, blue versus green. The results were striking. The monkeys paid no mind to the sex of the experimenter. Green or blue made little difference to them either. Significant majority of cases, they steered clear of the red-clad humans and stole the food from the other tray. The researchers believe that this aversion to red reflects an evolutionary adaptation. It is no accident then that humans know that red means no. While we learn that these influences are, the researchers want the organizers of competitive activities, such as sporting events and even academic exams, to avoid using color in ways that that may unfairly influence people, says Krolik. What they don't say, if you want to scare the pants of your rival, wear red. There are many other colors in the game. Cyan, blue, brown, yellow, orange, black, white, purple, pink, and light green. And surprisingly, they aren't as stimulating as the color red. I've been trying to find any similarity, but to my surprise, there isn't any other than black. Black color has kind of similar activities to the color red. So given the context and based on color theory, 
the color red is truly suspicious. Keep in mind that all of this is just my speculation and theory of it, and it is founded upon my little knowledge of psychology.